Well, here we go. I want to start a series on uh, basically literally just, just shop talk and uh, on investing, life, and all of it above. But right now, I just want to make it, at least specifically right now, this second, I want to make it on investing. And investing in reality is, um, it can become overcomplicated. It, it actually can. It can also be oversimplified. Or it can actually be what it really is. So if you enjoy it and you like it, that's one thing. If you don't and you want to let a professional handle your, your money and finances, that's a great thing too. There's nothing wrong with that. But there's a lot of mockery out there in, in our society and in our world. And especially what I do because I do this for a living. I mean, I've been, I've been consulting for the, the better half of a good over two and a half decades. Uh, specializing in the automotive sector, real estate, investment trusts, hold calls, op calls. I'm fully licensed, um, you know, fully, fully licensed. So uh, I let go of uh, doing stock arbitrage and convertibles. Uh, I really focus on portfolio management, hedging, and uh, trying to make, believe it or not, every single trade as profitable as I can. Now, look at what I just said. Make every trade or have it turn out to be as profitable as I can. I finally realized after a certain amount of time, like unfortunately most of us, uh, most of us do, is that you're not going to be right. You're really not going to be right. I don't care who you are. I know the best of the best, was trained by the best of the best, have paid them hundreds of thousands of dollars to be the best of the best, only to come back to, to Montreal, Canada, where I reside, and take my investment portfolio, invest it fully, and basically, you know, admittedly, lose almost all of it. And folks, all I can say to that is that's ego, okay? You are not going to be right. And when you're right, take it as a win. But it's no different than sports. I have never met, you know, let's talk about hockey. I've never met any, any franchise win a Stanley Cup, but yet go home all year long and win every single game. It, it doesn't happen. And it's not because they're not good. That's not because they're not professionals. It's just that, listen, there's a lot of variables against us. Investing is no different than life. It's actually, if you've got your life in tune, then your investment thesis and your philosophies will actually be in tune and you'll actually become a very, very profitable investor. It's that simple. Now, not to harp, I know I'm all over the place and I tend to do that. You know, I, uh, I suffer from scattering myself all over. Everyone who knows me says, Tony, you, you, you're fantastic, but you gotta stop getting scattered and getting off topic and then getting back on topic. But that's who I am, I love it. I don't know if I'll ever change. I try and every time I try, then I'm not being authentic. So I'll just be authentic. And you know what? For those of you that like my craziness, will love it. For those of you that don't, don't. But I will tell you that I'm extremely focused when I'm thinking and when I'm in front of my screen. And when it comes to investing, I take it extremely, extremely seriously. I can honestly tell you that I'm, I'm really, really good at it. Um, I'm not bragging. I'm just, I'm really good at it. My profitability is off the charts, but that's because I've accepted that my losses are part of it and I have no problem, you know, getting out of losing positions and letting my winners run. And also a big variable that I'm really, really good at is I'm really good at knowing how to take profits. There is no point in putting on an investment trade whether that be real estate, whether that be your business, whether that be a trade, whether that be an investment, there is no point in putting on some an acquisitional trade and being profitable and letting go, letting go of your goal because you become greedy. So that's my rant for today. I know it's nothing, but... I'll have, I'll, I'll start a series and I'll start getting into the technicals and I'll go deeper and deeper and deeper. But I wanted to break the ice and basically say, listen, the thesis and the main theme and the main message I got from this four or five minute video right now is very simply this. If you enter into any single investment, not just portfolio management or stocks or options or, or real estate, but if you enter into your investment, with an end goal in mind. Most likely, if you know what you're doing, you will become extremely profitable. It's when you do things blindsided for the fact of like, oh, this is good. 
and then it, it ends up being in your favor and it is good, and then you don't even take the bloody profits. There's a word for that and I'm not gonna say it online, okay? So I'll be, I'll be starting a series. I'll be throwing out some videos. Looking forward to meeting you all on the other side. Have a great one.